Is that that game kind of fun? Is that the kind of, the kind of game that's fun for the team where maybe it's not pressure packed all the way and you're just out there playing? I mean, yeah. You know, going into this game, you know, we always talk about playing to our standard, playing to Alabama football standard. And that means, you know, we don't really care who we're playing against. If we go out there and we do our job, like how we want to do our job, we're going to have fun and fly around. Uh, you've been having a lot of fun lately in recent games. You're, uh, and you've upped your game, I think, this year. Do you think you've upped your game this during the season? I definitely. Uh, you know, it, it comes in uh, preparation, you know, day by day. And, you know, just me creating great habits for myself. And also, you know, my teammates, um, you know, just allow me to make plays. Uh, you know, I give a huge big thanks to the D-line, you know, whenever they uh, make great execution on their stunts or in the run game to allow, allow it to be an open gap for the linebacker, to, you know, for the hole or whatever the case may be. Xavier had that fumble recovery, returned it for a touchdown. Whenever y'all are able to get a defensive touchdown, how exciting is that just for everybody? It's, it's very good. You know, that's one of our goals going into any game. Do y'all feel like you've been close to having a couple of those? Do you feel like you've had opportunities to score defensive touchdowns and it just hasn't worked? Or? Definitely. Uh, we had opportunities. Obviously, it, it, it didn't work, but it's all in God's plan. It's going it's to happen for sure. I, I think that's five straight games that y'all have had three uh, three or more turnovers or three or more takeaways. Just really? what is – yeah, what's the um, – <laughs> Just the mentality and, and how much of an emphasis do y'all put on that? Like, what's been able to – what have y'all done to be yeah, able to make see, that I, happen? See, I, I, I didn't even know that because, like, the whole goal is – my fault. the whole goal is really just no matter what the scoreboard is, no matter what nothing is, we go out there and we play Alabama football defense as best as we can. And, I mean, that's just the outcome. You know, whether that's a three and out or whether that's a turnover and a defensive touchdown, that's great for us. With a QB, and I've obviously seen some other guys step up. With QB now, how have you seen some other guys maybe step up for you guys on defense? Well, you know, just understanding what's going on. Um, uh, those guys, you know, they learn from all the veteran guys. And now, you know, we're deep into the season to the point where it's like we might need some, some young guys to come into the game and, you know, just play their potential. Man, that's speechless for that. That's definitely it's great, you know, just me going against those scout alignment and seeing them in the game, that's 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 one of like the precious things in football because you see how hard, for example, Austin Mack, he go out there and score and, and, uh, and throw a touchdown to Rico Scott, which is also a great play. But you see these guys every day at practice, and they're, excuse my language, but they're busting their ass every day. Like, they don't care if they're hurt, they don't care if they're injured, but they go out there, the scout team, they give us a look. I'm pretty sure the scout defensive team, they give the offenses uh, a look as well. And, you know, just Austin Mack being who he is, um, I mean, he puts in the work every day. He put in extra work every day, like he's a stylist. So that's what you're going to get out of him. Quay was saying that they